A group of South Florida veterans did not let the pandemic or the rain stop their Memorial Day weekend mission. Ruck marching through Broward and Palm Beach County in honor of the men and women who have died while serving in this nation's armed forces. WPTV News Channel 5's Arthur Mondale caught up with the vets who say the march isn't an event but a movement within a movement. There's a lot of people that would love to do this and they were never they don't have the option. Each year, Rock to Remember does a 60 mile movement that ends at Arlington National Cemetery. But with the cemetery closed to the public, local chapters did what they're trained to do. Adapt, overcome and improvise, keeping it local. It's natural. You know, uh, from one of my all time favorite movies, heroes get remembered, legends never die. The Ruck March included a 15 mile movement across Fort Lauderdale on Sunday and a six mile movement around South Florida National Cemetery on Monday. Day. But the truth is, we walk with those that we remember every single day of our lives. Uh, the ones that have fallen, that we served with, that we hold yeah. near and dear to our heart, that's something that we carry along with us every day and we live for them every single day. I don't take them off. His brother, Army veteran Brandon Limprich, wore three memorial bracelets with the names of friends killed in action. One of them, a special forces member whose death underlines the uncertainty of war. I was actually shot and killed uh, by an Afghan army member who just decided to just turn on us and decided to take his life along with one other. And I like to think that that's what drives us. Ruck to Remember concluded its movement inside South Florida National Cemetery, paying respect to generations of veterans before them, saying their work is still not done. I found that the military has been the most effective way to really to give back. Freedom is not free. Now, those veterans you just heard from say the heavy rains brought its own significance, a time for remembrance and reflection. Arthur Mondale, WPTV, News Channel 5.